Hey, what's going on out there? I'm Sean Devine. Hope you all are doing well. In this tutorial, we are going to be breaking down some very useful techniques as well as plugins to get your vocals to sit in the pocket with the beat. I get a lot of questions about how to do this. There's some subtleties to it. What we're going to take a look at today is going to make that process so much easier and it only uses a few plugins so you can really keep things simple it's zero latency very efficient on your system so let's go ahead and dive in i like to record my rap vocals with a lead a backing layer just to support that lead and then some overdubs or some uh, punches and then i'll wide pan these just to give us kind of a wider more exciting performance so again nothing on here i did track with a little bit of compression which is just something to note very light gain reduction maybe 2 db 3 db at the most how many ways to live how many ways to give would you abort when you come up short when you hold on tight driving down this road swerving through disappointments but the highs come with it peace of mind gotta go go get it where you find it quietly remind it it's not where your mind is looking up above when we need the love it's a subtle wink or the tap of touch on the shoulder climbing over boulders pass it all around as the world grows colder know that i got you all right, so let's dive in here and uh, gel and mesh our vocal and our beat together uh, much better with a very simple chain. Y'all with me? What we're gonna do first is load in a plugin called Vocal Rider, and we're gonna load the live version because again, this is going to be a zero, whopping zero latency chain so that you all can utilize this even when you're recording or you're tracking you don't want any delay and you want to be able to hear this process i automate a lot of different things in my mix but this is a tremendous time saver and it's very musical in the way that it will do this first thing we want to do is just go ahead and set the sensitivity for this vocal all the way up and we don't have any spill i didn't record this in a, a live environment so it should be very little in terms of ambient noise, you can adjust that if you need to. We're also going to activate this into the fast detection so that we're gonna get more of a, a fast reaction speed on the vocal ride. We'll talk about this music control in just a little bit, which allows us to do some very cool side chaining with our beat. We're gonna activate that, but we'll get to that in a little bit. As far as the threshold, what we want to do is just kind of pin this, you know, right where we're starting to get some of those unpleasant peaks and we're starting to, you know, see the inconsistencies in terms of dynamics of our performance. Over here in the latter part of the verse, I've got some words that stick out. So let's just try to set that somewhere uh, in there. Peace of mind, gotta go, go get it where you find it. Quietly remind it, it's not where your mind is. Looking up above when we need the love is a subtle wink or the tap of touch on the shoulder, climbing over boulders, pass it all around as the world grows colder. Know that I got you. If you need something, I find you. Stars connect and the sky realign. You gave up my old ways. High hopes, no fear, new days. All right, so that feels pretty good in terms of the threshold. You can experiment a little bit with the sweet spot, but again, if you put it, you know, kind of right below some of those loudest points and we're getting a little bit of the attenuation there, that's really all we need to start with. Now, going down to the range, this is just identifying what's going to be the loudest push on the ride that we're going to get and then also, you know, how much we're going to be pulling back on the level. Ultimately, this will just change the overall intensity of our automation ride. How many ways to live? How many ways to give? Would you abort when you come up short? Will you hold on tight driving down this road, swerving through disappointments? But the highs come with it. Peace of mind, gotta go, go get it where you find it. Quietly remind it, it's not where your mind is. Looking up above when we need the love, it's a subtle wink or the tap of touch on the shoulder, climbing over boulders, pass it all around as the world grows colder. Know that I got you. A lot of times, the first thing you all are reaching for is a compressor, and you're using it very aggressively, heavily, to the point where you're taking a lot of the excitement, a lot of just the interesting uh, performance aspects, and you're killing the dynamics. And so with something like this, we don't even need to use a compressor. We can just set this as a great option to get a much more natural tone and a much more reactive tone. You can hear there that the way things are working dynamically with this, it's just a lot more musical. All right, so we've got our dynamics feeling a little better there. Let's get the tone right so it's sitting properly with our beat mix. And uh, one of my favorite EQs, one I use often, 
in Studio Rack is the Manny Mariquin EQ just has a certain musicality and tone to it that you can't get anywhere else, especially in the top end. But uh, let's go ahead and first we're going to get rid of some of the chunk out of this vocal. It's a little bit fat, a little bit thick, and we need to get rid of uh, some of the excess thickness anyway. How many ways to live? How many ways to give? Would you abort when you come up short? Will you hold on tight driving down this road, swerving through disappointments? But the highs come with it. Peace of mind, gotta go, go get it where you find it. Quietly reminded, it's not where your mind is. Looking up above when we need the... I'm going to leave the high pass at about 105. I see a lot of folks out there starting to EQ things much higher than this, like 170, 180, 200, 250 sometimes. And, you know, stylistically, that might be the right thing. But just realize that you're not always going to do that. There is no such thing as always or never in mixing, like we've said before. Uh, but, you know, sometimes you don't want to uh, put it up so high. You want a little bit thicker character in your vocal. Now, I do want to add a little bit at 800. I just find that this notch here on the Manny Mariquin EQ is, is really nice for vocals to get things to sit uh, correctly here. So I'm just going to add a little bit of 800, maybe a dB, something like that. How many ways to live? How many ways to give? Would you abort when you come up short? Will you hold on tight driving down this road, swerving through disappointments? But the highs come with it. Peace of mind, gotta go, go get it where you find it. Quietly reminded, it. it's not where your mind is. Look Next up, I'm gonna take out a little bit of this 1.6K notch. Now, a lot of you see, you know, 1K, 2K is that frequency that has a lot of the presence, a lot of the impact of your vocal in a mix. However, it can start to build up. This mic has a very forward uh, midsection, and so I can just find that it can be a little bit much. It can also sound a little bit nasally, depending on the performer. So I'm gonna take some of that out. Up above when we need the love is a subtle wink or the tap of touch on the shoulder, climbing over boulders, pass it all around as the world grows colder. Know that I got you. If you need something, I find you. Stars connect and the sky realign you. Gave up my old ways, high hopes, no fear, new days. A little smoother sound there. And finally, the magic high end boost here on this EQ. We're going to go to uh, 12.5K. I like this notch for uh, my vocals in particular. And we're going to add, uh, you know, maybe two, three, four dB if we're feeling adventurous. Let's see. How many ways to live? How many ways to give? Would you abort when you come up short? Will you hold on tight driving down this road, swerving through disappointments? But the highs come with it. Peace of mind, gotta go, go get it where you find it. Quietly reminded, it's not where your mind is. Looking up above when we need the love. It's a subtle wink or the tap of touch on the shoulder. Climbing over boulders, pass it up. Gets that vocal sitting on top of the beat in a very pleasant way. I know we did add a little bit more sibilance to the vocal. Don't worry about that. We're going to tame that in a minute. But finally, I'm going to do a low pass, which this is something that you might not see as often on vocals. But I find that if you set this to you know somewhere between 16K and 17K, that might sound very subtle, but there can be some information up there that can kind of have that dog whistle sort of sensation and it's not on all vocals it's not on all microphones but you want to listen closely and uh, i just find that cutting some of that excess up there is going to make your vocal sound smoother also going to create a little bit more headroom up in that extreme top end peace of mind gotta go go get it where you find it quietly remind it it's not where your mind is looking up above when we need the love is a subtle wink or the tap of touch on the shoulder climbing over boulders pass it all around as the world grows colder know that i got you if you need something i find you stars connect and the sky realign you gave up my old ways high hopes no fear new days all right so let's deal with some of that harshness some of the sibilance there we're going to use the live version of sibilance which this works also in real time like vocal riders so we don't have any latency you can perform with this and if you want to talk about one of the most helpful but also slept on effects in terms of having vocals sit with the beat properly it's a de -esser. can't tell you how many times I hear both you know amateur mixes that people send me but also popular songs these days where you can tell they're trying to aggressively boost the high end to get that presence that brightness but then they're not uh, properly de or they're not using the right de for the vocal to get that tone right and not completely take your listener's ear off with that harsh sibilance. How many ways to live? How many ways to give? 
But you abort when you come up short When you hold on tight Driving down this road Swerving through disappointments But the highs come with it Peace of mind Gotta go, go get it Where you find it Quietly reminded It's not where your mind is Looking up above when we need the love is a subtle wink or the tap of touch on the shoulder Climbing over boulders, pass it all around as the world grows colder Know that I got you, if you need something I find you Stars connect and the sky realign you Gave up my old ways, high hopes miss, But the highs come with it, peace of mind Gotta go, go get it where you find it Quietly reminded it's not where your mind is Looking up above when we need the love Is a subtle wink or the tap of touch on the shoulder Climbing over boulders Pass it all around as the world grows colder Know that I got you If you need something I'll find you Typical DSer, you're going to have a wide or a split mode You choose between one or the other And that's pretty much all you can do With this one, you can blend between wide and split And when you start experimenting with DSers with that and also being able to blend in the detection mode, you know, whether it's a short transient, something a little bit longer, you can dial something in that is specific to any vocal and also a lot of different instruments that might have the same harshness, you know, a hi-hat that needs to be attenuated a little bit. This is just a very versatile uh, de to, you know, tuck back that harshness, maintain the brightness that we just work for. It's very transparent and that's not something that you're going to find in all de -essers. You still with me? I got a gym here in the NLS channel. Now, a lot of you are asking about saturation, how to subtly saturate your vocal, which is different than distorting. It's going to give you a, a fatness, a richness, and it's going to, once again, help with this beat and vocal blend, getting your vocal to sit properly in the mix. You can use either the NLS channel or the NLS bus. So if you wanted to you know, send multiple uh, tracks to a bus and get kind of that analog summing sort of effect and the saturation that's involved there, you can do that. Or you can use it as uh, just a channel effect, which in this case, I'm just going to send our vocals to an aux and we'll process it there. And all we're going to be doing is just uh, switching the type. So these are just different desks that model, you know, some of the saturation. I'm going to select the Nevo, which I assume is based on the Neve desk, but we're going to turn this up to about five, five and a half is where I usually will put this. I'll bypass and enable just so you can hear what a, a subtle but noticeable difference this makes in terms of our blend. How many ways to live? How many ways to give? Would you abort when you come up short? Will you hold on tight driving down this road, swerving through disappointments? But the highs come with it. Peace of mind, gotta go, go get it where you find it. Quietly remind it. It's not where your mind is. Looking up above. Might sound subtle, but it's certainly contributing to the blend, giving us a little bit of that warmth and fatness. Last step in our vocal chain that gets our vocals in the pocket with the beat, we're gonna go back and we're gonna utilize the side chain option with Studio Rack and Vocal Rider and this music control. It's gonna make a big difference in terms of our beat and vocal blend here. First thing we need to do is just go ahead and select the side chain input of our instrumental. So I've just routed all of my instrumental tracks to bus two. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, bring that all into Studio Rack, and then we can utilize that side chain here in any of these plugins. So in this case, we're gonna use it on Vocal Rider. I'm just gonna activate side chain up here, and then you'll see the music control is now activated. And I'm gonna bring this in slowly, but what this is gonna do is it's gonna utilize our beat with Vocal Rider and intelligently ride it according to that side chain signal. So once again, just creating more dynamics in terms of that beat and vocal relationship and in a very musical way. So let's slowly bring that in. How many ways to live? How many ways to give? Would you abort when you come up short? Will you hold on tight driving down this road, swerving through disappointments? But the highs come with it. Peace of mind, gotta go, go get it where you find it. Quietly remind it. It's not where your mind is Looking up above when we need the love It's a subtle wink or the tap of touch on the shoulder Climbing over boulders Pass it all around as the world grows colder Know that I got you If you need something I'll find you Stars connect and the sky realign You gave up my old ways High hopes, no fear, new days so you can hear as we bring that up, we get much more of a rhythmic and dynamic sound. You know, it's responding to the push and the pull of the beat, but it's doing it in a very smooth and musical way. Just makes it more interesting than, you know, kind of more obviously putting the vocal up front and just kind of leaving it. Let's do a final AB. I will uh, disable what we did here on the vocal chain as well as NLS channel. 
and then we'll bring all of this in here. How many ways to live? How many ways to give? Would you abort when you come up short? Will you hold on tight driving down this road, swerving through disappointments, but the highs come with it? How many ways to live? How many ways to give? Would you abort when you come up short? Will you hold on tight driving down this road, swerving through disappointments, but the highs come with it? Peace of mind, gotta go, go get it where you find it. Quietly reminded, it's not where your mind is. Looking up above when we need the love It's a subtle wink or the tap of touch on the shoulder Climbing over boulders, pass it all around as the world grows colder Know that I got you, if you need something I'll find you Stars connect and the sky realign You gave up my old ways, high hopes, no fear, new days All right, y'all, so I hear from a lot of you out there that are struggling with achieving this beat and vocal balance. You're using 10, 15 plugins, lots of compressors, lots of EQs, dynamic EQs, multiband compressors, and you're just using a lot of things that you don't need. You know, we used three plugins that are intelligent and they do exactly what we needed them to do in order to achieve this and it's also zero latency. So you can use this while you're recording, uh, just a very efficient way of doing this. If you have any questions about mixing vocals in the pocket with your beat, feel free to leave a comment below. Also check the description. I've got a couple surprises for you all, so definitely take advantage of that while you can. Big wink. If you learned anything in the video, please like, subscribe, and consider sharing. Thanks for being here with me. I appreciate all of you, all of the comments, the support, the encouragement that you share with me, but also you share with one another. A lot of great information being shared. I'm learning a lot. So it's really fun to be a part of this community. Please like, subscribe, and consider sharing. Hit that notification bell for more, and we'll talk to you soon.